am I? What is this place? Motel. Middle of nowhere. Any specific middle? Doesn't matter. You're not leaving here by yourself anyway. Why are we here? <laughs> Wanna talk about your little invention? Biochip you made for Arasaka. Fine. But let's get one thing straight first. Yorinobu Arisaka didn't send you? No. This means you must have an offer for me. If your boss will pay more than Kang Tao, I believe we can talk. You misunderstand me. There is no offer. What do you want? Got Silverhand's construct in my head. It's literally driving me crazy. And I know it's only gonna get worse. That is, unless I remove it. And that? None of that's on the billboards I saw. Not even in the Silverhand? Construct? That's impossible. Where did you get this biochip? Long story. If Arisaka finds me, I'm dead. So are you. So we are in no hurry. And I'm interested, truly. Clept it off Yorinobu Arasaka. Job for a client, but the client left me out of the And drop. you decided the best place for it was in your own goddamn head. Actually, wasn't a bad idea. Construct rebooted me when my own goddamn head took a bullet. I always knew Yorinobu's plan would fail. I just never imagined it would turn out like this. Arisaka's prized tech really is in the very streets of the city. You have to remove the biochip from my system. It's not that simple. Look, you made the thing, didn't you? So where's the problem? If you're telling the truth, you slotted in a new experimental version of the biochip. I know you can't just yank it out. My Ripper you said- You showed that to some fucking street doctor? Who else knows? I needed help. Or did you think the first thing that came to mind was downing a Kang Tao AV? How's the prototype version different? It's got a different engram, something more... Aware? Aggressive. The biochip is what's unique, not Silverhand's engram. The previous version of the chip was only used to communicate with pre-saved engrams. It was rare as fuck and cost a fortune. Yeah. This one's rarer. Meant to install and activate the engram in a new body. When I left Arisaka, the project was still in the trial phase. Yeah, yeah, great. Your tech works. Now get it out of me. Well, well. I would have to see it first. Whoa, we just met. Haven't built up that sort of trust yet. How did you think this was going to go? If you want me to help you, I must examine you. Okay. Hmm. Unbelievable. It looks like... Can't believe this Seuss the one who's gonna help us. Oh, fuck. What? What is it? What a pity I won't be able to examine it fully. Yeah, real shame. You could have been his guinea pig, too. Tell me how to get rid of it. <clears throat> I'm afraid I have bad news. Your neural network has completely deteriorated. It can no longer function independently of the chip. The only thing... I could Woo hoo, do, it's bargaining time. Is to give you information on a good clinic in Sweden. They'll help you through the terminal stages. Minimize the pain. Wait, you said the project was in the trial phase. You don't actually know how it'll end. Oh, I do. I just saw the construct devouring your brain. It's programmed to take over its new environment. At all costs. And your little meat brain is helpless against it. So no matter what, sooner or later the engram wins. Yes. And from what I've heard about Silverhand, that seems to be exactly his style. Huh. I see my reputation's grown into Arasaka legend. What exactly is going on in my head? You tell me. What's it like to have two personalities? Because it's not like you're hearing voices. You are both yourself and Silverhand, simultaneously. I 
can see him and talk to him. You're not talking, but yes, I understand what you mean. Have you noticed the Construct's influence on your decision-making? Jeez, give it a rest. When it comes to my decisions, Johnny really is just a voice in my head. Maybe he has a different opinion, but he can't make me do anything. Agreed 100%. You are one fucking stubborn. It's not host. as if one of you wins the debate. The scale simply shifts, slowly but surely. What do you mean? You will start doing things that were once unthinkable, at least to your old self. And you know exactly who he was. A fanatic. A terrorist. A suicide bomb. Well, fuck me. Who's trying to mess with your head now? That is why I believe it would be better for you to consider clinical isolation at this stage. At least Johnny never whored himself out like you. Are you defending him? Or is that Johnny speaking now? Oh, let me guess. He already tried to take over your body. You know, just for a little while. No. Would you, though? Could be fun. Johnny... Kidding. But watch out. Suit's getting ready to talk your head off. You know what? That's enough. Are you just playing for time? Because I can't tell. Are you trying to convince me you're useless? I mean, in that case, I can just shoot you in the head and save us both some time. Ah, oh, finally. I will try to help you. If you come with me to Kang Tao. Forget Kang Tao. Got any other ideas? If you think there's anyone else who can help you, I could give you the blueprints. Complete project documentation. Kang Tao offered quite the sum for it. You got it with you? He's got to. Gonk's fucking useless without him. Me? Takamura? What the hell is he doing here? He's got a few questions of his own for you. You play nice. He might even save your ass. I'm almost done. The blueprints. Better than nothing. Long as we find someone fluent in techno babble. He's all yours. I'll give you two some space. I hope we can come to an understanding. That is certainly in your best interest. V. I will remember this. Ah, this heat. My throat is positively parched. Mm. Did not see the way you see I that? What the fuck me? Just Easy look at man. that. That is not me. You will see the difference. I will keep uh. you from buckets. Sons of bitches. This is the part where you divulge your master plan to annihilate Arasaka? No. It's the part where I say I despise petty merc thieves who think they're hot shit rebels after setting foot in the <laughs> afterlife. Might think you took on Arasaka, but you're just a bug they scraped off the sole of their boot and tossed in the trash. Got yourself killed by him, too. And I'd just as soon not take advice from a digital corpse. That what they teach folks in soccer these days? To shut down, cut power the moment truth looks them in the eye? Sure seem to know a lot about my past. Well, seen flashes of your past, just like you've seen flashes of mine. Honestly, I'm scared of the day I'll start seeing your memories as my own. Shit. If it's a two-way street, I'll somehow have to live with the fact that I let Deshaun best me. Fuck me over. Can you just tell me what you want? What you really want? Help me settle my score against Arasaka. That's it. Your goal is to bury Arasaka. Demolish it. Minds to stay above ground. Seem pretty clearly defined, both. Actually align pretty nicely, too. 
You need Mikoshi to save your life? That done, I can burn it to the ground. Ah, there it is. The crusade. Get to Mikoshi. Smash the system. Okay. I'll tell you why I want to destroy Arasaka, but I'll only tell you once. Want to hear it? All right. I saw a corpse strip farmers of water, and eventually of land. Saw them transform Night City into a machine fueled by people's crushed spirits, broken dreams, and emptied pockets. Corps have long controlled our lives, taken lots, and now they're after our souls. Might be right. Can't really argue with you there. V, I've declared war not because capitalism's a thorn in my side or out of nostalgia for an America gone by. This war's a people's war against a system that spiraled out of our control. It's a war against the fucking forces of entropy. Understand? Do whatever it takes to stop them, defeat them, gut them. If I gotta kill, I'll kill. If I need your body, I'll fucking take it. Johnny, take a sec. We gotta... Fucking hell. You still Johnny. don't see it, but you will one day. This place just reminds me of dates with my ex-wife. Same goes for your whining, actually.
My husband and I, we need a somewhat delicate matter handled. We think you could help. Why call me, of all people? Any particular reason? You came recommended. Yahoo, bye. I'd rather not say. Not over the phone. Is there any way we could meet? Discuss some details? Sure. Let's do that. I'll send you the address. See you. Hi there, V. How's it going with Rogue? That's going. Knock on wood. So, things are settled. And now we're good at avoiding each other. And that's fine with me. No complications with Kang Tao. So far, so good. They sent another patrol around the station. But they're dead set that it was Raffin that downed their AV and attacked Hellman's guards. Station's proprietor's sticking to that version. So we're covered for now. Make up your mind yet? About what? The Aldecaldos? Going back? Part of me just wants to drive down the open highway and never look back. Part of me wants to stay. But being in the same room with Saul... I don't know anything anymore, V. Sound like you don't have any friends left there. What about Mitch? I know, but... All right, you're about to tell me that no family's perfect. And hey, you'd be right. But I just want to be true to myself and figure out what I want. And what I'm scared of. Take care. Talk soon, V. It is good to see you, V. Seems pretty, uh, secluded here. It is appropriate for such a secret meeting. What the hell happened? <laughs> Look close to awful. You see a man robbed of his implants, money, and dignity. Look well. It is not all bad. I am mostly unnoticed in the streets. Friend you mentioned here? Oda? He should be here any moment now. Willing finally to give me the spec on him? He's Hanako-sama's bodyguard. Hanako Arasaka's? From the carrier at Anchor in the Bay? Saburo's daughter? Yes, and if he believes you, we'll next meet with her. Just hope he doesn't blindly follow Arasaka protocol. What protocol? Unwritten rules. Had him here in Night City. Could be different in Japan. If IA got even a whiff of treason, they'd prep an enhanced interrogator and send two elite squads with air support to grab the suspect. I understand the point you seek to make. But if Oda has ulterior motives, he will need no elites, no air support, no one but himself. Trust me, I have seen him walk. Mm. That's supposed to be reassuring? If it helps you stay calm, you can gaze at the sky. By God, huh? A good sign. He's usually camouflaged. Speak for myself, you know. So speak. I have been told you know things. 
Not gonna like what I'm about to say. I need a guarantee I'm safe here. You are, you have it. V, you can trust Oda. All right then, Compeki Plaza. I was there the night it happened. Looked like your typical family quarrel until your Nobu lunged at Saburo and started Silence. Checking. Not one word more. You will bring death to your door. But it is the truth. Hanako-sama must hear it. My one concern is to keep her safe in this city forgotten by the gods. Is she in danger? Now? No. Yet during the parade to honor Arasaka-sama, most certainly, I bring you this witness to his murder. And you dare to worry about the silly parade? Fool! Correct. But Unlike... you can't ignore the truth! Correct. Unlike you, I have not yet failed to keep my oath to do my duty. You will regret those words. The only thing I regret is that I came here to meet you. There is a price on your head. I do you a favor now, by not cutting it off. Sorry, up. but this is gonna take much longer. Wanna make it to the top? I do you a favor now, by not cutting it off and taking it straight to Yorinobu Sama. What would you do now, were you in my place? I do no favors. I would deliver you ahead to Yorinobu Sama. Consider yourself Raki. Oda. That... Not like we're asking for a whole lot here. Just one brief meeting. Hanako should decide if what we say is true. You can't decide for her. Will you help? I will not. But I will let you leave this place, this city, unharmed. If I see either of you again, I will not be so lenient. Be very careful, my friend. We are all so far from home. Good fucking riddance. One hour sock of whack job is already plenty. Well, can't say we didn't try. We tried, yes, and obtained something useful. Did it? Hmm, how do you figure that? <laughs> what Oda said. They returned to Tokyo after the parade. Do you not see the parade? It is our chance, perhaps, if somehow we can get to Hanako-sama. We must do a proper reconnaissance first. We'll need a precise map of Japan town. Hold on. It is your turn to call on friends. Do you know a fixer who could help? Now just the fixer, Dame. Wakako Okada. Runs a pachinko parlor on Jig Jig Street. We must pay this woman a visit. Will you join me? Sure, why not? Street. What is this name? <laughs> Just a night city name. Beware, you mock me too often. Any idea what's going on at Arasaka? Only what I can surmise from what I see on TV. Yorinobu and his puppets grin at the cameras and insist that everything is under control. But the wider the smile, the bigger the lies. You all right, Goro? Yes. Why the sudden concern? Have shared interests, you and I. Or have you forgotten? Certainly not. Good. Because catching lead in Night City is easier than catching a cold. And I need you alive. I am alive and well. As you can see, you should worry about yourself.
tiger paws, tiger lizards, ugly tigers. What's shaking, Night City? Your man's. Hey, you're looking for some company tonight? I didn't know you'd do that. <clears throat> I miss the sun. <laughs> Rogue, my sweet. This has got to be a misunderstanding. I've no idea who jumped your team, but the claws? No, never. My boys know their place. I, I'm sorry, got to go. I have guests. Some serious tabs going on. Well, well, who do I spy but V? In my humble parlor, no less. Okako, long time no see. So what brings you here? And your charming friend is? Happen to be working together, that's all. Takemura Goro this. Ah, a true gentleman. Ah, oh, shame only that he's being hunted by all Arasaka's tin soldiers. And you, V, bring him to my door. Give me one reason why I shouldn't notify the proper authorities right away. Caution. Caution? World's most wanted Japanese fugitives hiding out in Night City, and you got nothing to do with it? Please. We know they're thinking. They'll link you to us faster than you can finish puffing on that sig. So tell me, and mark well, I still have my phone at hand. Let's start with the eddies you already owe me. Sandra Dorset job. Weren't in any rush to collect before. Surely you can wait a little longer. V, now is not the time. Tell Okada-san what we come for. Need intel on the parade that's scheduled to come through Japantown. So it's Arasaka. Again. What I fail to understand is... Why come to me? Did Mr. Deshawn not come to the phone? Goro, remind me why Dex's fat, backstabbing ass is currently indisposed. He is deceased. Butchered and dumped at a landfill by some Arasaka goon. Real shame, that. That a threat I detect? No threat, no. Asked why I couldn't reach Dex. I answered. Just facts, nothing more. Good, because you would then have to join him. Okada-san, our intentions are honorable. We need just information. It is a matter of life and death. Everything's on the shards. How much does this cost? My pockets are empty. Clearly. My gift to you, it's free. Okada-san. What is free often proves most costly. Gonna take them or not? Japan Town. Whole district is to be sealed off for the parade. 
Dashi platforms, the main attraction. They'll fly this way, high above street level. Along the parade route, balconies, footbridges, and vantage points affording good views. Hanako Arasaka, a guest of honor, will deliver her speech from the largest float. She'll do this exactly here. Got no idea about security, but given recent events, expect it to be tight. Our last parade? Arasaka undercovers infiltrated the crowd. Not to mention a smattering of sharpshooters, drones. And if that's not enough fun for one day, a net runner, one at least. They use the city CCTV to observe everything. Main access point, here. It's an old automated control center. If you ask me, most useful by far. At the end, the floats will float out of Japantown and we'll be left with trash up to our elbows that no one will collect. That's it. It's all I have. It must be enough. Then go. Be on your way. Thanks, Wakako. We appreciate this, Okada-san. A delightful, mature woman. This information, <clears throat> it could be just what we need. But I will try to investigate further. I will stay here some time and call some associates. The moment I learn something new, I will let you know. Stay safe, Goro. You as well. Until next time. Your pardon. You look like a man whose last best hope is a stroke of good fortune. You do me think so. Fortune is like a new life. I've got to go in. That is. No, perhaps. Perhaps not. I am pursuing this. Some side quests. I think there's some stuff I could pick up, but I had no idea what I was doing. I'm kind of learning as I go. What are you doing up there? here when and where. You don't know how good it is to hear that. Swing by the Aldecaldos camp. I'll explain it all. The Aldecaldos? Thought you parted ways. Oh, look, it's a long story. Just hurry over. I'm here.
weird how it just changed direction. T-Bug's death. What did you hear? The truth. She got burned. Like anyone who tries to hit Arasaka. They found the body in her pad. Nervous system fried. You know what that feels like? Can't say I do. They say it's like a hundred thousand knives stabbing you at once. I can't imagine a worse way to go. Poor girl. I liked her, too.
V, it's good you're here. What happened? Spit it out. The Wraiths took Saul. The Brick Brain ventured out with a small patrol and never came back. Sure it was Wraiths. We've been observing their camp. We know they're holding prisoners, including someone important. We need to free Saul. I don't know why, but I felt I could count on you. Always, Ben Am. You and me are chooms. Thought that was clear. Careful, or I'll start believing that. You won't be able to get rid of me. I'll survive, I'm sure. Whatever goodwill you might feel, I'm sure you won't turn down one of the best sniper rifles on the West Coast. A Tektronica Grad. You saw it in action already. That and the gratitude of the Caldos. Sounds fancy. Once you have it in hand, fancy all of a sudden becomes kick-ass. Let's go. Mitch will walk you through the details. Well, I'll be. Pan Am and V, what's going on there? Her? After what happened to Scorpion, she shows up here? Guess probably for Saul. Ignore that. Hey, Pan Am. Seriously? You really aim to do this? Someone has to. You know you have a piston missing, right? Someone has to. Where's Mitch? He was supposed to meet me here. He'll be here any minute. Huh. You never mentioned seeking outside help. We can use all the help we can get. Okay. How do you want to do this? Quietly. An open assault would be suicide. Mitch is already setting up the recon. You'll sneak into the Wraith's camp while I cover you. Not going in quiet. Two's all you need. It's not that I don't want to go to serve some raffins up some justice. It's just... Look around! The last attacks left barely half of us standing. Our supplies are stuck outside goddamn Reno, and our gear... Don't get me started. We're up shit creek, static. And I don't know if we're ever gonna find or fashion a paddle. Try as we might. Leader gets nabbed and you what? Hope for the best? Rather not think about what you do for the ones at the bottom of your food chain. You're asking for trouble. Leave it! She has a right not to understand. There's Mitch. I floated a drone over the Wraith's camp. <laughs> Will you take a look, or would you rather keep mouthing off? Let's see what we got here. The Raffins can't see it. 
active camo, but that practically inhales battery juice, so make it quick. They found an abandoned cement plant to squat in, with a mass of heavy gear. Locusts would be a better name for them. They fly into a place, strip it of all it's got, then move on. But this time, do you see the wall? They've added some primitive security measures. It points to them aiming to stay longer. The question is why? Who knows for sure, but I would guess that Saul is part of the reason. He's still there. We have to find a way inside. That guard post is probably connected to the rest of the camp. Our way in? Maybe, but there are also breaches in the wall. Lightly guarded sections. Do you see the tracks? Tire tracks. Their vehicles were moving heavy freight. It could have been equipment. Either that or Saul's not their only prisoner. Mm. The tracks lead to the truck. Can you scan it? That's probably the one they kept Saul in. The main building, there. Saul must be inside. Quite a spread. Be like looking for a diamond in a hailstorm. If they haven't scrapped and gutted the place for parts, you could access the local camnet. You would just need to find the control room. The Skywalk. It connects the garage to the main structure. Okay, got some stuff to work with now. Is everything clear? Yep. Let's go get Saul. Perfect. Mitch, is the van primed? I did what I could. Take a tour. Solid job. I mostly improvised, actually. Either way, it'll have to do. Hold on a minute, I got one more thing. If you find Saul hasn't flatlined, you'll probably need this. Spike Superjet, a rhino dose. It should speed up Saul's central pump. Hope so. Doubt I could carry him on my back. So that should be everything. V, will you ride with me? Yeah, of course I'm going with you. Okay, you take the wheel. Want me driving? Yep, I need to fiddle with my scope a bit. Uh, that's where we're gonna stop for today. We're gonna get Saul back, see what happened from there. Uh, if you like what you see, leave a like, drop a comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. I'm having a lot of fun with this. Let me see if I can...
I want to thank you guys for watching. If you like what you see, leave a like, comment, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. It means a lot. It helps the channel grow. And honestly, I really do appreciate it. Until next time, love you guys. Hope to see you again soon. Take care, and I will talk to you later.